Today we're going to make a beautiful sous vide chuck roast. It's my version of like a budget prime rib, a discount prime rib. The first thing we do is liberally salt this on both sides. Salt's gonna help it stay moist and add a lot of that flavor. Yeah. Next thing we're gonna do is just gonna hit it with a little bit of cracked black pepper. Just a little bit of pepper just because it adds a great depth of flavor. She wants the fame and she bad. We obsessed with all the shit that never lasts. I think it's crazy that you fell for me, baby. We could be together, ooh, ain't it wavy? But you don't even wanna see. Okay, so after the black pepper, we're gonna hit this with a little bit of MSG. I know you guys are worried about the health effects of MSG, but there really don't seem to be any in humans, and it really adds a lot of unami to the dish. So we got a lot of richness, a lot of savoriness, makes it taste beefier and meatier. And so it's a really great addition. After that, we're just gonna hit with a little bit of garlic powder. Garlic powder is the best way to get garlic flavor into a sous vide dish like this. Finally, we just hit it with some woodsy herbs, so some rosemary and some thyme, just to really give it a little bit of herbaceous flavor and those are going to hold up the best of this kind of cooking. Okay, all we're going to do next is put this in our vacuum bag and seal it. Now, you may be wondering why sous vide. Well, there's a couple reasons. One, the temperature precision allows us to make sure this is cooked exactly how we want. The other thing is, we can use this as a low and slow form of cooking. So as we cook this for an extended period of time, the collagen or connective tissue in this meat is going to break down and form gel gelatin. Now this gelatin has a great mouthfeel. It really um, makes the beef tender and flavorful. And so what we're hoping to accomplish here is to really get some flavorful beef from a really cheap piece of meat. For a word, few months she done. Had to cut it off like the outside crust. Ain't about to wait around and waste no time now. Gotta make a move like an outside cut. Yeah, the that's the mature me. Okay, so now we take our beautiful bee, piece of beef. We're gonna put it in our sous vide water bath at 130 degrees for 30 to 36 hours. That could go a couple longer if you needed it to. And after we take it out, after 30 to 36 hours, we're gonna make sure we dry the surface as good as we can, because the drier we get the surface, the better sear we're going to get on this piece of beef, and that's gonna make it taste better. We obsessed with all the shit that never lasts. I think it's crazy that you fell for me, baby. We could be together. Okay, I hope you didn't throw away that flavorful liquid from your bag. We're going to strain it right here through a fine mesh strainer. Then we're just going to hit it with a little bit of chicken stock. Just enough. We're making like a jus to dip it in, but it's not exactly that. This is just a really easy way to do it, and I'm really, really lazy. So this is how I do it. All we have to do now is get a really good sear on this. Put this in a ripping hot cast iron pan, it should be smoking, and get a really good hard sear on both sides of this beautiful piece of beef. But it's early in the game If I got to make it obvious I came here to say That there ain't a fucking chance That I'm gonna give this up today Yeah, same thing I knew then I'm understanding now that I'm better Yeah, they don't wanna show me love What's in it for them is what matter How this fake shit goes Now I'm grown, got some goals All these narrow-minded poses Never ever coming close Nah, what the fuck am I saying? Working so hard but I still feel helpless Don't have time to respond to your message how am I doing? I'm busy with the post Stuck in a mess, I'm waving goodbye To everybody trying to take what I got Don't tell me that you're fucking with the story If you're only about to spark, no Wasting my time, I know you're trying to take advantage of my work I'm seeing it pretty clear Gotta double down, I'm covering both ears Ain't nobody sleeping, I'm working up on the weekend Ain't my fault that you don't appeal, nah Had to start rapping again Thinking that I found my sound, yeah And sooner or later gonna learn You cannot keep me on the ground Hoping and I pray that someone believes in me, yeah, yeah The ones who can relate You have been my everything, yeah, yeah Wishing them the best Cause I need that energy. And 
look at that beautiful beef for your money some of the best tasting beef you'll ever have and as we cut it open look it's medium rare all the way through and so tender it's barely staying together i'm telling you guys this is one of the most delicious things i have ever made try this one out and if you enjoy this video want to see more stuff like this like and subscribe to this channel you guys it helps me so much when you do that and i love all of your guys' support but look at that beef you guys look at it